Well, got another story. This one is out of uh, a country called Mozambique. I mean, I, I'm probably not pronouncing it right, but basically it's an, it's an African country. Uh, and just once again, throwing, start showing the kind of fruit of Islam. It says here on jihadwatch.org, it says Islamic State raids Christ, uh, six Christian villages and murders eight people. Biden's handlers are giving $140 million of U.S. taxpayer money to rebuild Mozambique, I think that's how you say it, after the devastation the Islamic State has wrought, but the Islamic State is still there. What will become of all that money? Yeah, exactly. And plus, you know, money won't help anything because why? Islam... These Muslims from the Islamic State are just doing what Muslims do best. They're just following, being true to their demonic blasphemous rabble known as the Quran. So it says here, um, ISIS has claimed responsibility for attacks on several Christian villages in Kaaba, Delago, Mozambique. I think that's how you say that country name. Uh, that happened between May 23rd and May 31st. Six villages were attacked, leaving eight people dead. Four of those who were murdered were Christians. Following the attacks, ISIS released photographs of six decapitated bodies as well as images of the burned villages. Mozambique is no longer is no stra no stranger to Islamic State attacks. Uh, the Islamic State or its affiliates have killed or displaced thousands of Christians in Mozambique. Well, hey, just doing what Muslims do best, really, just being true to their demonic, blasphemous uh, rabble known as the Quran. Just like when Jews, uh, Talmudic Jews, attack Christians in Israel, they're just being true to their demonic, blasphemous rabble known as the Talmud. Or when Papists do what they do, they're just being true to their uh, pap uh, papal decrees. Or when the Hindus do what they do, they're just being true to their holy text or unholy text i put it that way so it's just that simple so once again we have an example of muslims displaying genesis 16 11 and 12 to a t they're wild men just like the scripture says so don't be deceived by the whole muslim victimhood mentality uh there definitely are cases where muslims are unjustly attacked i'm not advocating violence against muslims but stuff like this goes against the whole media narrative of this muslim victimhood mentality so don't be deceived by the grace of our lord jesus christ be with all the brethren goodbye